Hey everyone, back again. Welcome back to another video review. This time we're going to be taking a look at the Transformers Generations Titans Return uh, Legends Class Wheelie. Um, as you can see, his Ultra Mode is much like his G1 self, is this nice little Cybertronian space car, and it's pretty cool. I like it, it's very nice. He is not meant to fit with any Titan Master per se, or <clears throat> but he, um, I'll show that in a minute, but. Primary colors will seem very G1-esque, the orange, dark orange, light orange, or beige. Um, does have some orange for the back headlights, uh, silver for the grille, uh, silver here um, for his... This is this piece is going to be his butt in robot mode. Uh, side panel details right here, and the wheels aren't painted, but that's okay. I can easily fix that with a Sharpie or whatever, but yeah. Wheelie here is a nice looking addition. Doesn't come with any accessories, doesn't come with any, does have an Autobot symbol though on the chest there, but you can open the canopy and then you can fit a Titan Master right in there if you want. Um, I'm gonna see if I can, I have a plenty, a plethora of Titan Masters at my disposal, so I will go and find one if I can. Uh, this will take me some time. So, uh, and I should have planned this ahead, but I didn't, so never mind, I will, that's okay, because I do have Loudmouth with me, so if we put Loudmouth, that you've seen his video review, uh, you can pretty much, um, if you can, um, <laughs> it says, the, the bio, the, the bio cart says you can fit Titan's Return uh, or no, it's meant to go the other way. Oops, yeah. So you can put them here, and then you can close the canopy, and then we, ah. <laughs> yeah, so. And there's a massive crash. Really. <laughs> yeah, anyway, so flip it around, and then we can get Loudmouth out of there. Because his he has his time, he's, had his review and so anyway it's very nice um i like that feature it's pretty neat uh but here's the thing here's the one thing i don't know if you can tell um i'm gonna get the camera sorry i'm gonna get the camera adjusted here i don't know if you can tell but you can see wheelie's face um in the back there so um <laughs> though junk so junk in the trunk is taken literally uh anyway all in all, I mean, if that, that, if that bothers you, you can just rotate the head, but if you rotate the head, its face is going to show up the, uh, outside the vehicle mode, but anyway, all in all, I, I wish there was just a panel there to, to cover that up, but what can you do? All in all, Wheelie's vehicle mode is beautiful, very, just love the details, I mean, it should have, it should have more paint and stuff, but what can you do? Anyway, so the transformation for a view to robot mode is very... It's interesting, it's unique for a Legends class figure, and I'll explain that when I on my final thoughts. But anyway, first thing you want to do is split the legs like this, and you will rotate. Basically what you want to do is ro rotate this little panel here, and then you just want to flip the legs around, turn it around. Yep, rotate them around like this. Take this wheel piece, flip it around to fill the cavity for, for robot mode, and do the same on the other side. And then make sure that the legs are Flipped around and you want to rotate this, rotate the legs around like that. Then you want, what you want to do, take the take the arms, split them open, take the cockpit, flip it around. Then what you want to do is you want to rotate the bias or waist, we'll ro rotate the waist. And then you just want to um, essentially, you want to take this little piece here, you want to basically sandwich them together, accordion them together nicely. Uh, well, not yet, because what you need to do is so open this little panel here, and you want to come to his head here, and you just want to push it. You want to push it, uh, no, push it to the other side. You want to flip it around if you can. It's a little tricky, but flip it around like this. Then you will have enough, then you'll have enough clearance, so that way you can, uh, you can basically, uh, according to the, the pieces together, flip this. Flip this channel, channel. Flip this chest piece around like this. Then you can flip the head around, and you can flip 
the chest piece like this, the last little bit is to rotate the arms forward so you can see his hands. Um, and there you go, there you have Wheelie in robot mode. Oh my god, he's just so, he's so cute, he's so funny, he's just, he's amazing. Very G1-esque, I'll say that. Articulation-wise, his head can rotate side to side, um, arms can go full 360, they can go in and out, out to the side, bend at the elbow, they can rotate, um, and they can pop off, but that's okay. Yeah, so, yeah, bend in, rotate, that's really it. He has waist, um, due to his transformation, but the legs go forward and back, up to the side, bend at the knee, uh, they can, uh, they will rotate, um, yeah. Oops, <laughs> I think I may have, um, anyway. Thanks for back out to the side, but the knee rotate. No feet possibility, I wish Wheelie had that, but what can you do? Anyway, taking a look at his head, it is very, very cute. Very, <laughs> yeah, it's just so nice. Like I like the, um, the teal blue eyes. His, his, obviously, it's very spot on with his G1 counterpart. It's pretty neat, especially the details around his his inner self and whatnot, and the Autobot symbol, of course, on his chest. Yeah, all in all, Wheelie here is an exceptional figure. Um, well, I, um, anyway, all in all, well, I recommend getting him. I'm gonna say yes. Um, I just the all. I mean, if you remember the the GDO or the Generations Deluxe Wheelie that we got a few years ago, it came with his um, it came with his little um, slingshot that he had um, in the G1 movie. Um, I'm gonna say yeah, like you you can don't you can definitely use that for this Legends class figure. But as um, I'd recommend getting him highly. He's outstanding. He's cute. Though the transformation, if you want to go back to vehicle mode, is a little tricky. So because you have to be precise with the fact that you have to get all the panels and pieces lined up like so well. You have to do that because that's the only way you're going to have to get success in vehicle mode if you really want to go back to that. So, but all in all, Wheelie here is an exceptional figure. You won't be disappointed by him. I'd say get him. But I mean, I, I if I had to rank the Legends class, and here's the thing. Here's the thing. Um, wave two of the Legends class figures came out um, before, and this no joke, before um, wave one. So that was weird in itself because I saw Rumble. I didn't get him, but I'm gonna get him uh, at a later date. Um, but this time I got Rewind and Wheelie. Um, I also, other than Chop Shop, I also found Stripes, which is pretty neat, and I also uh, <laughs> found the big surprise. Um, it's, um, I'll give you hints from the Combiner Wars, so you can guess that in the comment section below, and then, yeah, so anyways, Wheelie here, exceptional, you won't be disappointed by him, and I think he's look, is an exceptional figure. Um, so yeah, that's my review of the Transformers Generations Tanks Return Deluxe, or not Deluxe, Legends Class Wheelie, I'll see you all very soon, I'll be, oh, wait, before we do that, uh, nice little silver detail on, on the crotch area, but I want to show you the bio card, I forgot to show you that. Uh, there is his bio card, which is pretty neat. Come, he he is shown with the slingshot, but it doesn't come with it. It's weird, I know. But you can give him the original, like generations, like le deluxe class version of that. His speed is more is as an advantage over his strength, his skill, and intelligence, er, his firepower. Oh boy. Anyway. Like I said, get Wheelie, you won't be disappointed by him. He's amazing. So that's my video review the Transformers Generations uh, uh, Legends Class. It, Transformers Generations Times Returns Legends Class Wheelie. I'll see you all very soon. I will be back as soon as possible with my next video. And yeah, so take care, see you soon, have a good day, and I'll catch you all later. Bye bye.